Life in a world that keeps changing Think that it's progress you're making Copy and paste pretty faces All the time Picture so perfect we play Nigeria hmm. Every day different thing and they happen for that country This one now the women don't verse For women both old and young To match Come up for house. This one at the second day. They don't day for Chevron, Nigeria Chevron. They say they know they go anywhere. Say because even for their house, they never they sleep safe. They know they sleep with two eyes. Now one eye, they think they sleep. And this one they happen for inside Baramatu Kingdom. Like for women like this to so come say they won't go on protest. They know they sleep for house again. Now Chevron. When I go see the display where the women they display, I will continue to they bring all the updates. You understand? But because Nigeria don't get as it be to the extent where we say we are all here for the comma. People who even they around the surroundings, they don't even they get anything to testify say now nah, this place is all here for the comma. Then just they use ear, they hear and they use eye, they see them. But at the all year they go, they don't know. Nigeria government, time don't reach now. Eh? Different different things they happen for Nigeria every day. People they come out to come they protest. We don't want to do the needful. This one are mothers, mothers. Let's talk about it. The all this Nigeria government self, not Mama Bono. Now, even though I'm not even listening to the men, now I'm still listening to mothers. Now, since okay, since the mothers don't come, I'm gonna give them waiting. Then they find you know, they my people make I drop the video, make I hear them. But before I will drop the video, make I welcome my old and my returning subscribers, my new subscribers. Welcome back to my channel. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I greet all of you according to now time. I remain your friend, your sister, your girl, anointed lady. I beg if you're not the first time we'll be seeing you come across my channel, you are highly welcome. Thank you very much for stopping by. And if you never subscribe, I beg make you help me knock that subscribe button, put on the notification bell so you continue to get update from this channel to my other my returning subscribers thank you very much for coming back to watch my content i want to drop the video quickly and please do not fail to leave your comment down below like and also share god bless you as you do that let's watch the video <laughs>
stayed over 30 years. We discovered that on the 17th day, February 2021, we discovered that oil is coming out from the center of the river. This is not where somebody will not go and uh, uh, cause problems to that pipe. No. It's at the middle of the river, over seven feet. Uh, uh, seven uh, fathom. Now, deep down the water, we discover people staying around that area discovered the women they discovered that oil was coming out from the river and uh, the, the fumes coming from the water, from the, from the crude oil was suffocating the people they reported to the chairman Bonazi Solomon Aries the community chairman and we notified Chevron that come on your pipe your asset, your facility, something is coming out. So please come and uh, ascertain what is going on. We are seeing crude all over the surface of the water. So come and uh, ascertain. Let us do an investigation. If it is true that oil is coming out from your asset, let it be a clean up. Let us let try to uh, curtail it so that it will not spread over everywhere. But Chevron refused. Chevron paid deaf ear to what we are saying. And this crude was, in fact, it was coming out every day. 
on the 24th of February 2021, we we came to that place and we see that about a week ago at that time, crude were everywhere. There was visible presence of crude oil on the surface of the water. The river bank was filled with oil. So we notified Chevron again, please come or something is wrong with your pipeline that passes this our place. Chevron says it's not their water, it's not their pipe. It is not their crude. On the 25th of March, that is about uh, uh, over, over a month, in the presence of Chevron personnel and the surveillance team, they all witnessed the oil coming out from the water. And yesterday, the 26th, we registered our presence here. And this is Abitaye flow station. We said we can't take this any longer. The crude has spread over all our communities. Down to Oborogbone community, uh, Santuagbone community, Ogbagbone community, Biagbone uh, uh, community, Edilegbone community, Pilikrukru, Kiyagbene, you know, a lot of communities. Oporoza and all over. Oburukriya and all that. Dabrio, Zion, Benedaya community, all these places have been covered with oil. And we said, Chevron, come, and even though, let, let's, let's assume, let's assume that this crude was not coming from their own assets. As, as people who have been working with this place, with, with us, as us community, they would have come, okay, even though it's not coming from our facility, let us see how we can take action and, and clean up or, or bring relief material to these people. It is part of their social responsibility, which they would have done. But they left us to our own fate. A lot of people were suffocated with this gas that was coming. The smell coming from the crude oil can kill someone. Some people fainted. They were rushed to, to the clinic. Some were rushed to Kokidagunas. Some were rushed to Bilikupu. Because of the, the smell coming. Now, on the 19th, Nimasa came. The, some of the workers said they can't really... They, they, they were not... One of the lady, she was almost fainting. Said, "Let us leave this place because the gas that was coming out was suffocating her." You understand? Now this thing has caused a lot of damage to our people. A lot of them are sick. Now the fishing traps have been damaged by what? By the crew that is coming from the from the from the from from from, from, from the pipeline. Just only yesterday, they shut down Otunana and Makaraba so that the crude will know what passed them. Look at it, over six weeks, crude has been coming out regularly from their pipe. And these are all communities to turn from. They would have come and said, ah, let us, let, let us do something to, 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 to appease, let us, let us treat them, or let us bring food items to them, relief material to them, until we will now ascertain what is the problem, how they didn't take that. Until they saw it with their eyes that it was really coming out from their water. We are here today, day two. We're not going to leave this place. We're not going to cause any harm to the facility. But we'll not allow any of their personnel to come out of this facility to go and carry out any of their activities. We will be here until the managing director of Chevron Nigeria Limited will come and address the little group community. We'll come and say of a truth. We have seen it. Or carry out an investigation, maybe a joint investigation. But there is no denial again. They have seen it. Their personnel have seen it. What are we saying? Today is the two. We're not going to leave here. Tomorrow we are here until it is one week, one month, we'll be here. This is our own place. So we're not going to leave this place. That's why we're still here. This is about uh, early in the morning now. Overnight, we have been here. We have been here keeping all night to make sure that none of their personnel will come out and do any work. We will be here until the managing director of Chevron Nigeria Limited will come and address our community. Thank you very much. Today, particularly, the Nikukuru communities has come together over oil spill that has been rocking the river and life food has been threatened people find it very difficult to eat they can't breathe that has been the situation on ground since yesterday overnight pro uh, protest rock chevron 
a beauty gate here in Bori South West local government area of the last state here in Maramato Kingdom. And uh, it is sad that women sleep on top of uh, iron for just because they want to tell the whole world that their life has been threatened. We can't sleep comfortable in our homes any longer. Let us come to this place and die here. That has been the issue on the ground. And uh, it will interest you to know that we are going to speak with some of the women. How were they able to cope overnight of this ordeal? Because it is life-threatening. We ought to hope that uh, Chevron will listen to the plight of the people and address this as soon as According to Mama, she has been stolen, having a sickness of stolen, just because of the situation of the oil. It has caused different kind of ailments to the people. Some can't eat, some can't live comfortably. Their life has been threatened. That has been the price. And we also speak with some other person to know what has been. Et on a I'm still on the protest matter, and people of Benikuru still have Chevron Abitia gate. And waiting days so the matter to get us to be because some women don't they even they talk for here say if Chevron people don't come down from where they need, they know how people are come up here for overnight and so then still they get back for here. And they don't they almost they break, they still they then nobody even close eye. Some people when they manage those old women that they carry their small small food when they say be like uh, iron, take like that for here, they wait for Chevron officials to make them address the matter. My country people, the tea get us bill. Some people still they call on them, get the state government, make them come quick. If they not come quick now, the thing will turn to another studio. And I be the story when they for grand so and the thing get us to be as old women leave their house constantly sit down for years. Yeah, um, uh, Chevron gate they don't go go. As far as them self no go feed chop so themselves no go feed leave their gate, go work, get money, take feed their stomach. 
nine be the truth, so they don't block everywhere. Them no going out, no coming in. Now be the matter when it's day for years. So, but I'm not too first, still I can't follow them. Wait, wait. Um, for the afternoon, they don't come break again. We still did the gate. But we know whether they will still come to truth and address this matter so that the women will joyfully go out. That's the they call on government. Say, this oil company people should they know say this thing that them from their pipe now this thing take up. But they don't care now. So then they deny you when they deny the night say don't be there, don't be them. Today they're not financing now really that they are this thing now from this thing they come from. Oil they come from. River don't square finish. Fish is going to die in here. As the thing will be so they get us a bit. Then they call on the Chevron officials, make them bring food, where they could take sustain their life until they come clean the environment. Now it be the matter when they're the young for years. Now so they take the job, take crap and missing say back and use broken, take pigeon, take crap up the matter. And the thing get us a bit. But we we'll still talk to some people whether the uh -huh. they won't talk, right? Tell us the other thing that they have. And then I mean on the side of the again. on the gas for the place. So they come the young say, make them come. Today now it go, it go the matter goes strong go well, they well, say they go walk out, enter the gate. Yes. Make no one yeah. not come to do anyhow. Now so the woman takes okay. it for a job. Uh -huh. So my country people now still pollution matter when it's day for Niger Delta. The matter don't they go well well not be only for you. Different places now this thing they have oh yeah pollution don't they walk out they enter all the land all the Fish is all they die in here. Before you know now, before 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 now, if you set your nets now, they say fish is broken everywhere. But now you toil throughout the night, say nothing they come aside. On God on the day for the land. Then when we say they don't get <laughs>
Amen.